Joe here from Bolton Town Vlogs, and it's back to league action today for Bolton Town after their break. In the FA Cup on Saturday, we got a 1-1 draw. Today's game against Ilkeston Town, local derby away. It's going to be my first away game of the season, Bolton's second. It's uh, going to be another tough game, obviously playing Saturday, Monday. And in the uh, sweltering heat, it's going to be very tough. Tough game for lads today to be able to grind out a result, but I hope they do. We're very good, you know, unbeaten in the league so far, two wins out of two. Keep the 100% record going as long as we can. That'll be excellent. Ilkeston, they're not going to be a pushover. They're going to, uh, they're going to work hard, make it difficult for us. But we, if we can match their work rate and endeavour, which I'm sure we will, and then our quality hopefully will shine through. And yeah, just uh, just going to touch on Saturday briefly. I think yeah, a lot of people uh, expressed their opinions on the on the game afterwards on Twitter and. I actually, in itself, I think that's a good idea. It's, I think it's good that the gaff is going on Twitter, you know, saying his opinion. I think it, I like the transparency. I think it's good, and I even though it's, it was different to mine, I I respect it, and hopefully that that respect comes back to me. So I think what we can take from Saturday is that everyone has different opinions, and you're allowed to challenge people's opinions, but you have to still respect them as people, and and remember that ultimately we're all part of the same club. Even if you don't like someone's opinion. We're all part of the same club. We all want to pull in the same direction, and we all want the same thing, which is success for the neighbours. So yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna to get to the game now, and I'll see you there. Come on, Nathan. Come on, Nathan. Come on, Nathan. Oh. Oh. Hey. Hey. Oh. Ten men, I thought we were the better side. We put a shift and in this hot weather it can't be easy. We've had a good chance from corners, Danny South being held a lot, but the officials don't seem to see it. Half time, Ilkeston. Come on, Milford! Come on, Milford! Oh! Yeah. We've got more than Sarah Fred George Milner. I don't think you understand. It's just well blast man, it's better than he can. We got super George Miller. Hey! What? Oh, oh, what? Oh, oh. You fell off my senses like a gallon of penny, like a bucket of porch, like a night out in Melbourne, like a greasy touch special. Last super nailers, come fill me again. Na 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 na. Who the open? We do. We love the open. We do. We love the open. We do. Oh, open. We love it. Come on, open. Come on, open. Come on, open. Oh, 
He wears a magic cap. We've only got ten men. We've only got ten men. We've only got ten men. Really well. So full time Ilkeston Town nil, Belper Town nil. I thought it was a uh, a really hard battling performance from the uh, from the lads today. I thought uh, first thirty minutes thought it was pretty even. Probably was slightly the better side. I think the sending off uh, we didn't really get a great view of it, so I'm not going to comment too much. Apart from that, I thought the ref didn't have a great game in general. And I think all the officials didn't either. So sending off, but uh, I thought. Tactically, we set up really well after that. We were very organised. Second, for end of the first half, we had a few, we had a few half chances. Uh, second half, I thought we were really disciplined. The lads kept the shape really well. Track back, stuck to their task. I thought Nathan Curtis was excellent defensively today. I thought Milner looked good going forward. I thought Derry Robson was excellent. Watty coming into the side had a good game. Danny South as ever, stalwart in defence. And Ryan Musselwhite came up with a couple of key saves as well. So. Uh, all in all, I thought it was a very good grafting performance from the lads up against it. It's not easy to play with 10 men for 65 minutes uh, in the, in those conditions, having already played two days before. So I thought, fair play to them, they really stuck to the task. And, and we may look back at the end of the season and say that was a really valuable point. So, good performance, still unbeaten, still up there on the table. On to Glossop on Saturday, another tough game. And, yeah, well, that's it for me. Uh, my... Drop a like if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you're new, and uh, my name is Joe from Tell Time Vlogs, and I'll talk to you in a while.